I just got the DJI Ronin RSC2. I'm gonna be showing you three shortcuts, like uh, tips and tricks to get around different modes to enhance your workflow while you're out there filming. So you're out filming and then you wanna vlog for a few seconds and you just wanna turn the camera around. All you have to do is uh, triple click this trigger right here and um, the gimbal will automatically turn around and just face you. And let's say you're done vlogging and you wanna go film what's in front of you again, double click the trigger and it will go back to normal. The second trick is to get the gimbal into sport mode. So sport mode uh, can only be accessed through holding down the M button, that is the, that's the mode button, and then double click the trigger and then let go of the mode button and you'll see a little guy like running like a little uh, figure on the screen there. That means that you are in sports mode. What is happening up there? Having like a party or something. They're literally having a party right above me. What exactly is sport mode? Sport mode is when you're out there and you're filming and you want like, you're turning real quick. It follows very quickly. There's not much lag. It's like pretty much no lag at all. Like it, you, it turns with you. It's not like, cause some of the other modes, when you turn, it'll like take a little bit to come back around. But sports mode, it is very quick and very responsive. So let's say you're done filming sports mode. You want to go back to normal, hold down the mode button, double click the trigger and uh, let go of the mode button and it'll be out of sport mode. But that's, I think, one of the only ways to access sport mode. I think you might be able to through the app, but I don't know any, of any other way. Trick number three is when you're in the briefcase position is uh, when it's down below. And um, when your camera's right here, you uh, turn this knob right here and it loosens uh, this middle part right here and that allows you to almost like crack it open right there in the middle. It's kind of weird, but you just want to make sure you have clearance and then uh, tighten it. And uh, as you can see right here, there's a thread. Uh, uh, there's a hole for a thread right here. And so then you can take your tripod grip and actually, I gotta use my other hand, and actually put it right here um, for an extra arm support like this, where you got two hands now. So now when you're filming underslung, or I mean briefcase, you can hold it like this instead of just having the two like that. And it'll just really help. You can like reach out, you know, you can just, it's kind of cool uh, instead of just leaving it down here. And then you just uh, take it off and you can put it back on the bottom, maybe. I mean, and then what you can also still do it just like this if it was underneath. Um, I just like that a little bit better, but then you just loosen that up, bring it back, tighten it up, and then you're back to normal again. So those are my three uh, favorite tricks and shortcuts to get around different modes and different um, handheld positions on the uh, DJI RSC2. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I actually just got this like a week ago, so you're probably gonna be seeing more RSC2 videos in the future. I really like this gimbal so far, um, but I'll be making some more videos about like cases and um, also some shots that I get with this gimbal. So um, stay tuned for more gimbal videos and LumaFusion tutorials. See you next Thursday.